Hey guys, Shane Farmer here, Dark Horse Rowing. Wanted to give you a follow-up to yesterday's video. We've had a lot of response. We've had a lot of people reaching out, asking questions, speculating as to how this is happening, what's going on. And at the end of the day, there's no real magic to it. We reached out to Concept2. Obviously, uh, they didn't have a ton of time to respond as well. But Peter Dreisigacker, one of the founding brothers of Concept2, reached out and helped us to understand what was going on and also wanted for everybody to be able to understand it uh, so that we can limit the exposure to what this is. Remember, the point of yesterday's video was simply to evaluate whether or not this was happening and to draw the conclusion that this is absolutely a cheating of the system and in no way anything that you should use. I'm going to read Peter's quote directly, cut straight to the chase, and we'll let it be at that. There is no magic here. I believe what you are experiencing can be explained as follows. There is a time limit programmed into the monitor of six seconds from the finish of a drive to the start of the next drive. A delay of more than six seconds signals the monitor that you have stopped rowing. Among other things, this allows a user to pause to take a drink or pull off a sweatshirt during a long row and then continue the row. The monitor's self-calibrating function uses the completed stroke cycle, drive, recovery, drive, to determine the drag factor to use in calculating the correct data you see on the monitor. Unfortunately, by pausing for seven seconds before you start your next drive, the monitor assumes that you have stopped rowing, and the monitor never, quote, sees a complete stroke. It determined you had stopped rowing before it could sense the end of your recovery. If the monitor never sees a complete stroke, the drag factor will not be correctly determined and the data displayed will not be correct. In terms of getting a valid score, what you are doing here is like painting 45 on your 25 pound weight plates. Peter. I want to reiterate that last statement. This is the equivalent of painting 45 on your 25 pound weight plates and claiming that you are getting a true result. Let that sink in, but that is your answer. That's why it's happening. Don't evaluate it as anything more than a party trick and a way to just route around the computer. Other than that, go about your day, continue to work on good movement and mechanics. There's nothing to see here. We'll see you on the other side. After that initial response, Concept2 sent along a further note to follow up on, uh, on what's happening with this hack. And I think it's important to listen to because as we're all understanding and as this is coming out, we're realizing it, it really is nothing special, nothing magic as we said before. But I wanted to go ahead and add this piece on for your consideration and also so that we all understand where this begins. So this is again from Peter Dreisgacker, one of the founding brothers of Concept2. We'll be honest. We're not too worried about people trying to work out at strokes lower than 10 strokes per minute. However, we are nothing if not thorough. Since a customer has raised the question, we are looking into opportunities to upgrade the firmware so that the quote seven second hack is no longer possible. This hack requires a stroke rate of nine strokes per minute. The Concept2 performance monitors are not designed to calibrate based on activity performed at less than 10 strokes per minute. It's important to understand that this machine is meant as a workout tool. There's no reason that somebody should be rowing at less than 10 strokes per minute. The only time that I've seen that is when we're implementing the counting drill of a five or a seven second count. That is specifically for drill purposes and in no way tied to performance. If you are using this machine with this in mind, you are using it completely incorrectly and you're missing the point that this is meant to induce work and to help create fitness. Also, to help rowers perform better at what they do. A stroke rate of 10 or less, there's no purpose for that in a performance basis, so don't use it as such. Guys, thanks for watching this. We really appreciate all of the comments, all of the questions, and everybody jumping in to, to try and help solve what this was. And at the end of the day, Concept2 is already on it, and they're ready to bring you a fix. We'll let you know more as it gets updated.